Yeah, so 100, 150 TV down. So I would have still probably got this match, wouldn't I? I would have probably just... No, oh, this is the one that Shawnee conceded to. I would have probably still got this match, even if I'd even if I'd sacked that 120 guy. So... Oh, well. Looks like I'm about to uh, concede as well, then, eh? Claw Pond. Claw Mighty. Only 11 players, though. <laughs> oh dear. Yeah. No, there's there's somebody else. There's not just a base who calls them digger for for Yeah. Yeah, exactly what Skuro says. I can disagree with people and provide opinions why I do and not be a bit doing it. So the door match was the door zone match it wasn't great though, was it Wolf Bark? That that was the that was the only thing that I've done that wasn't constructive in any way whatsoever. Because at least when I was like bashing Dode for like the things that he'd done, it was because I didn't want it to happen and stuff and I and it angered me so much and all this kind of bollocks, you know? Um, like only because of his decisions angered me and his attitude in the forums angered me and all this kind of stuff that's why I insulted him but this was just and it was you know I don't know I was trying to show my disgust with his opinions but just just streaming that game to like laugh at to laugh at him was crap wasn't it it was crap to be honest so it was just a laugh but it was a laugh but he, he didn't <laughs> him and Zunk didn't see it that way did they you know, that's the that's the thing, isn't it? I thought it was just a laugh, yeah, but it was it was a bit you know, I can see their point of view and that it just looks like an attack, doesn't it? For no no reason. Free bribe somebody with a claw bomber who's given me a free bribe, which is nice of him. I guess he tries to make people like Shawnee concede. <laughs> now, Shawnee, now. Yeah, I mean, it was just me and it was me and Shawnee having a laugh with back is what it was, and then taking the piss out of some things. But it wasn't. It wasn't. There was. It wasn't noble, was it? <laughs> that was the thing. I wasn't. I wasn't on the side of justice or anything. So. <laughs> <laughs> Poor Shani. And come on, that's banter. That's banter. I'll stop abusing you. Alright, no banter. No, I, there's got to be banter, hasn't there? But just not. Not a complete arsehole. Right. I'm going to try it. Oh, yeah, don't be a whiny cunt. Right, there, that's, that's one. That's on the page. That's on the paper there. <laughs> it is like being a heel in wrestling. But, but Wolfbark. But Wolfbark. That guy, who was he called the best? Who was the best heel ever in wrestling? The guy, uh, Andy Kaufman, was just genuinely fucking hated. So, it's not that good, is it? It's good for the business of wrestling, but it isn't good for him. So, <laughs> you know, that's, that's the problem, isn't it? Yeah, I was thinking of that Viking of Mars as well, yeah. <laughs> Nah, heels don't really have redeemable quality, Skuro. Because literally, what's he called? Uh, Roman Reigns actually attempted to murder Seth Rollins in kayfabe, and they just cheered him on. <laughs> There's no redeeming features for heels at all. Um, but but that that's so he's not really an incredible heel. You shouldn't like heels. Heel, he's not doing his job. You should hate them. You know. They should be hated, shouldn't they? They should be booed out of the room. Andy Kaufman was the best here. Because people genuinely wanted to fucking kill him and stuff. <laughs> so. 
So that's the thing, isn't it? Yeah, exactly. Rons was the heel for that. There's, you can't cheer on attempted murder if there's a redeeming feature. If if Rollins had any redeeming features, he was literally, <laughs> you know, fucking what's he called? Roman Reigns literally tried to murder him, and they cheered him on because he was the heel. Yeah, that is the problem. That is the problem. I mean, that is a problem with the way Double Double is, isn't it? Really, they're not meant to be like that. No, you know, you know by the commentary scroll do because literally Seth Rollins just did a curb stomp and they were like, oh my god, that's the worst thing ever, and then Reigns attempted murder <laughs> was just, they cheered on <laughs> just because Rollins is a bad guy, so therefore deserves death, <laughs> which, <laughs> which is a little bit extreme in, in my opinion. Right. Blitzing him would be good, but I want to want bit his dirty player, don't I? Because I can hit him, for sure. Hit him with Mighty Blow, come in here. He can try to block him, then he can try to block him, then he can try to block him. I don't really want him to be able to one dice the ball and get it because he's got edge four, hasn't he? Blodge. You could run around and hit the ball one dice, so I think gotta carry on the block. And could maybe it's not. Could maybe carry on him, seeing as he's out of it. Fuck it. I'll try to play properly then. And I blitz him in here. Block, block, block. Get a big foul in. See what happens. Well, yes, I would want to be a flare heel on Twitch, yeah. But. The best heel would be just the best heel in the wrestling terms would just be hated, wouldn't it? That would be it. Oh, <laughs> hello, lemon is good. <laughs> oh, God, bless. That's good, isn't it? It's a lovely start in the match. Guard locked, strength locked, and uh, be rolling loads of ones. All right, don't be a whiny cunt. The ETA is, there isn't an ETA at the moment, but I mean it will happen. It's not permanent, the laptop. Yes, yeah, that's fair. Yeah, that's fair, Skuro. Yeah, it wouldn't, doesn't work for me. If I was to be a heel, I would have to be one for the qualities, yes. Like The Rock. The Rock was the best, I think. I think, uh... I think The Rock was the best, but then he was, yeah, he was too likeable, wasn't he? That was his problem, he was too likeable. Greed is good. <laughs> Greed is right. Instant reroll, yeah. After he waits, after he waits, he, he lets all the time run down picking inducements, lets all the time run down doing his setup, lets all the time run down on the kickoff, but then when he gets his blitz, he's, he's activated and rerolling instantly. Mm. Yeah, this is going to be fun, isn't it? Okay, so he could GFI, push him to there, and then he could go 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, GFI. That's my only play then, isn't it, really? Um, I 
I need to punish him for being shit. He was punished for being shit. Alright. Maybe rains, yeah, rains, but entirely unintentional, yeah. <laughs> yeah, that's true. Glorious! Glorious. <laughs> Please make your next guy on the team Mac Barfagger and let him get killed in the worst possible way. <laughs> Thank you very much, uh, VIP Mr. Yamandem, for 10 months. Thanks for staying fantastic. Um... <laughs> actual serve and actual punisher. 98 left. <laughs> Thank you. <laughs> um, this is tough, isn't it, really, with these these actions here, because he is going to break through and put pressure on. Um, I guess I should go for the pickup. And make sure I can't get blitzed or even based. Give myself options or go down one side. I think going one down one side's fine because I've got these four players on. I don't really want to get blocked by Clawpon, but then he's gonna blitz for it anyway, so it's not really that important, is it? One dice on him seems shit. Um Alright, so one dice here first. One dice here. Got a pretty good, pretty good turn so far. So I think if I if I leave a gaping hole here. Dodge him out there and I'm two dice is claw guy, can't I? I'd really like to not get clawed as well. Uh, double one. So I guess if I'd let if I'd just passed the turn he would have double skull, that would have been good, wouldn't it? No bucket bong, of course you won't, because I've got no I've got no problem with Sage at all. So there you go. Heyman and Brock are the best faces, yeah maybe. Maybe Sproul did. Heyman when he was with uh Heyman when he was with <laughs> Heyman when he was with Cesaro was the biggest team. Because he's there with a the fucking best wrestler. Fucking promote and Brock every week. <laughs> I don't know whether I should get rid of that or not. <laughs> that is good though, isn't it? I'm oh, getting fucked here still. Even though I started off with that removal. It's just all his his only strategy is herb dirt base base base, isn't it? And that is it. But unfortunately when he's got strength advantage, guard advantage. Killed that guy. Armor because he had armor eight. Yeah. Died because he had armor eight in the first game. Good. First game with armor eight dice because of it. It's fucking brilliant, isn't it? Right, can one dice him without block? <laughs> 
so that he can two dice him. Or he could one dice him without blocks, so he could two dice him. And he can just run around. G a fighter two dice him, and then the ball carrier fouls. Ball carrier blitzes, retreats. Goes into the danger zone if he does that. One, two, three, four, five, six. Could just one dice with him. But then that doesn't do anything. That's a three plus. I've already failed the three plus. Could bolt him. Then I could blitz him, block him. And then just foul him. Seems poor though, doesn't it? Oh, fuck it. Let's go. Dead guy's in the way a little bit, isn't he? So that's something. Of course. Seems cool. He's in surf danger at the moment, isn't he? One, two, three, four, double GFI can only base. If he dodges, can block the claw down. So I guess blocking the claw down is more important than stopping him getting served or anything. Okay. Block him away at least. And then he can scream. Whoa, where'd he go? Maybe there, so he's got to get an assist on him first. Yeah. Don't be big show. <laughs> no, I'm not going to do that. Biker. Yeah, it's, this game's always going to be tough, on it? Like, really, it's just one Kaz to two kills, so it's not going terribly yet. And obviously, after the Blitz. It's annoying he's got so much claw and strength and mighty blow. I'd have had an extra apple if I didn't have that warrior. Well, then I guess another warrior would die. I guess I can't apple badly hurt. Still got 10 players after that. Up to up, base, base, base. Literally his only strat. It's all he's done. <laughs> In the entire game so far, <laughs> it's herb dirt base base base. Right, let's start the map the turn with a risky move. I 
I'm not this there, but I can't really. Can I? He just has to stand up. I should have done. I should have done those first, but no, I didn't care. Mostly. To be fair, I got lucky with the stun. He's got lucky with the fucking castle, hasn't he? Can blitz him and then move back. Didn't want to give him one dice in the ball. It'd be too easy to get one dice in the ball, wouldn't it? So, might regret not having that assist. No, well, shit anyway, of course. He can't avoid getting claw mighty blowed. Mm, apart from dodging away. Try being Kevin Owens. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah, it could be Kevin Owens. That's the thing about Kevin Owens. He's got he's got the body that the fans could actually get. <laughs> no one can pretend to be the ultimate warrior. But you can you can actually you can be like, yeah, I could be. I actually could be the next Kevin Owens. <laughs> Even though obviously yes, he's good at wrestling. But do you know what I mean? Superficially. Taking a perm yet because that, that dead guy I should have sacked at the start of the game anyway. So. Holy shit, he didn't even pile on. I like that his bribe has got me two fouls and I've achieved nothing. Now he's going to make one foul and fucking get a cast or something. Yeah, yeah exactly, Stotty. That's the thing, isn't it? It's That's the thing. It's like, what brings in the more money for the company? And it's clearly... It's clearly guys like Ultimate Warrior bring in more money. So, like, you know, well, okay, it's it's kids that bring in more money, should I, should I say. So, therefore, um, you know, who, who even cares? Who even cares if somebody's a good wrestler or not? Don't know what the fuck I'm doing here, by the way. Got no players and no chance. Might just concede. Can't stop him without dodges and all sorts of bollocks. He dodges out and goes to like here. And then 
he one dices, he one dice, he, then he one dice, then he two dices. The dodge out of there is not enough, is it? So after GFI, put GFI out there. It's a warrior. I don't understand him just to get knocked down. They have a tense, good. I guess I could follow here. Now then you could you could get surf more easily, but it'd still be a minus three. I want him just to get fucking hit by him again. I don't want to give it a blitz and a claw on hit. But then I can try these, and then if it works, it's good, isn't it? Don't want to take the extra armor for a hit, though. Hmm, but if I hit that, then he blocks. And he's going to blitz him anyway, so fuck it. Oh, hello, Sen I-89. Should play dog is like a room. <laughs> no one's ever failed a two plus, no. I haven't failed a two plus in all these blocks against warriors, which is pretty good. Yes! <laughs> oh, fuck you! Uh, well done, Turkey Fagor! Your sacrifice was worth it. Get the guard through there. It's hard to protect the ball and hit the claw bomb, isn't it? <laughs> Um, maybe I have to not hit the claw palm. I don't follow to keep him free. He can go through now here to get a 2D on him. 2D on him. And then think about the blitz. Also, just running away from the beast is a good idea rather than blitzing and fouling him, isn't it? Finally failed the foul appearance. Okay.
Hmm. That was, a, that was kind of an annoying one to fail as well, just as things had the chance of going right. The GFI are there to keep that kind of screened off. Beast can only get to there. He could stay where he is, so he's protected. Warrior could come out in front. And then move in seven guy and cover the backside. One, two, three, four, five, six, double GF. If he wants to GF, dodge and double GFI to one dice the ball, hmm, that's probably the best chance he's going to get. What about if he comes geophised to there, then it becomes just a 3 plus through. Oh, but could put him there. Hmm. Could put him out in front. And then leave that warrior there. He's down three. I'm down three, but two men are permanent, but got a reserve. Yeah, obviously just makes the claw bits on him. That was the problem. Potato for a Christmas miracle. <laughs> <laughs> He's only got one reroll now, so that's something, isn't it? But unless he GFIs, not last action, the beast is a little bit abandoned, or the claw pommer's abandoned, or something. That's what you get for making a dodge, dickhead. <laughs> <laughs> to be fair, although I failed, uh, although I failed the first dodge, I made a lot after that. Oh yeah, this is huge if he makes his GFI. It's 50-50, isn't he? But a really stupid. Oh god, yeah. Oh, so maybe hmm, it was hard to stop him getting the beast in there, though, wasn't it? Fuck. Two dice him, two dice him, two dice him, get some cover. Yeah, okay.
all gone tits up. Maybe I should have re-rolled that. This is rough, isn't it? Fucking rough. Two dice on the ball with claw pot. You can just block the forward and get the assist that way anyway. But then this would let me one dice in. Two guys, this card. Fucking, oh, this game is horrible. The Blitz, since the since the Blitz, he's just had all of the uh, all of the initiative, hasn't he? And it's just been on the back foot since turn one. Although it was fun surfing that guy, it did it did fuck up my thing. But I haven't fucked anyway. Yeah, but it is a smart move though, isn't it, Eriku? Claw pumping is claw pumping is better than pushing. Mm. Of course he is. That would have been me casting him. Now I've given up on the game with that not happening. My paper's here, but I mean, I'm trying not to be a whiny cunt. I think that's the only thing applicable in this game that I can do. I mean, it's it's hard, isn't it? I don't see any way to do anything here. Um, the good thing is there's two turns left for him, so he probably's not going to score. This guy is really the only scoring threat. So I could put in a guard, blitz him. Could also just foul him. I want to be able to foul him. That's that's all I can do at this point, isn't it? Is foul him somehow? One dice blitz on him, and then follow. Then he can two dice him. Then he can two dice him. Then he can two. Dice him, then he can do, no, no. Then he can't. He could, then he could two dice him, then he could two dice him. If it's a pal. I chain him out from his assist on the farm, not really. Should I just get a canoring threat just in case? There's an argument for it, isn't there? One, two, three, four, five, double GFI. You can base him with him.
I don't think there was a chance if I was listed. It. Because he'd just catch me, I couldn't screen or base or anything. I just couldn't couldn't protect the ball at all. I don't think. Yeah, exactly, Emperor Augustus, just trying to survive, that's it, that's why the apple. I mean, if I was trying to win, I would have appled the claw, but that that was the point where I gave up on the win, and uh, or even the draw, and just trying to survive, you know, the match now. Sad thing is he's better off claw bombing me than surfing me, isn't he? Gets an extra chance with a plus one. Alright, foul chance next turn. And maybe a chance of a touchdown, you never know. Oh shit, yeah, maybe I should have stood him up. He didn't put him in range. <laughs> he didn't even put him in range. He just ran away. Instead of putting foul appearance on him. Maybe he thought I was just running away with this guy. But obviously he can score. I've obviously got to, I've got to use the wizard for his, his drive and maybe win 1-0, haven't I? That's what it that's what it is now. Right. <laughs> the fuck is this? Um We could red dice him. And then he could blitz him. I guess just trying to get the foul is better than trying to score. He could stand up, he could blitz him. He could blitz him. Hmm. I could two dice him, and then I could go for the dodge throughs, pass, or some bollocks. He doesn't have a scoring threat. He does have a claw pummel, though. So I guess just attrition is. Because it's so hard to get the touchdown. If we could get a guy in there, the chain obviously would be alright, wouldn't it? But. Can't do that. I'd like to one dice pal him and then block him and then get a two assist foul, that would be alright, wouldn't it? But after one dice him first and then one dice pal him. Nice stand firm on the reason. And surf the whole team here, probably. I knew it wouldn't break down. This guy's top chaos, is he? Ah, oh, maybe that's why he's just trolling then here. 
Do you think he's just do you think he's just sniping streamers on purpose to piss them off? <laughs> With his brainless kill team. He's top chaos, wow, he's played bad. He's gonna win though, because he's, he's he's made he's made three cars. <laughs> And he got a blitz. He got a blitz and he's got a strength advantage, guard advantage. And he's made three cars. And mighty blow advantage. And piling on advantage. <laughs> didn't even put didn't even put his Noga Warrior in range. Like how bad is that? Like how even bad is that? It's it's outrageous. Could have just scored if he if he just had put him in range. Oh, no KO recoveries. Oh, so if he recovers, no, of course not. No, still still men down. <laughs> oh, it's equal in it. Eight versus eight. I've got 12. So it's 8 versus 8. Unbelievable, Jeff. With a wizard. Maybe some kind of chance. Should be able to overtake them now. Even if this is a loss. Yeah. He's left with five slow players. He's only got three players that can handle the ball. And I've got eight that can handle the ball. If I'd been his drive, it'd been pretty good, wouldn't it? Because it almost was his br his drive of him getting the blitz. If that had been his drive and it <laughs> and I'd managed to stop him scoring and kept it nil nil and then been receiving eight versus eight, it would have been amazing. I get an extra reroll can push it. Push my luck. Just gotta target his just kill the skinks, isn't it? Target the uh, rotter and the besties. Ready for the insta reroll again. Didn't unbelievable, Jeff. <laughs> well, not 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 three removed so far. I think I'm gonna go for the the seventy five percent knockdown on the beast. Mm, no, I didn't get it on the other guy. Can I? Oh yeah, fine. That's pretty annoying. He's gonna get one removed. <laughs> there was no, there was no way that wouldn't remove. You know, after my fucking six fouls in the first half. <laughs> fucking bastard. Oh man, the fireball of doom if he does this. <laughs> he realised. Still a fireball because 
This guy going down is amazing. This guy going down is amazing. Getting him down is amazing. Four targets, including the three good players, is just amazing. Oh, yeah! Oh, got him. Glorious. Pretty fucking glorious. Also, I've still got players left at the moment. So... Yeah, that was pretty good, wasn't it? Oh, yeah! Oh, God. I love Blood Bowl. Yeah, that was pretty good. Right. He's unfortunately in the way, so he has to go first. Obviously, after Blitz him with Claw. Go here with him. One, two, three, four, five, six. Mm. Mm. He could GFI to make it harder for him, but at the moment he's got a one dice from him. He could double GFI at the end. All right, so go for the pickup first. So because I've used the reroll, now the GFIs are looking a lot worse, aren't they? He could GFI to tag him. He's alright. And he so he just gets in there without rerolls now. That was a shame, because I would have liked to have gone the GFI with him, GFI with him, two GFIs with him. And then it would have been really fucking pretty safe then. But now it's obviously really easy when you just one dice the ball. Not crazy hard to two dice it. PS4 champion level 5 ball. <laughs> yeah. yeah, he's going to 2 dice. He's going to do the 1 dice to 2 dice. But it would have been pretty safe if I'd if I could have made the GFIs. But anyone, you know, even if he gets the ball back, I can still I've still got a strength four guy with block, haven't I, to uh, to get it back off him and stuff. Double pal. Yeah, me too, Jelly Deals. Me too. <laughs> See, that's why I didn't want to make that extra re <laughs> that extra GFI. <laughs> uh, bastard. Right, safe moves first. He's up. He's getting his guard in. Technically, I could have blocked there, and then he could have run around, but... Just blitz and base the ball, isn't it? Oh, you can't. <laughs> no basing of the ball. Okay. See what happens.
Yeah, be the narwhal it does. It does, even if you have it set to not do it. Yeah. Yeah, Jalil's correct, yeah. Yeah, when your opponent selects the players, yeah. Yeah. Yeah, you can only stop it moving when your opponent moves his players. You can't stop it moving when you do it. When we could reroll, yeah, maybe. Maybe. But I mean, let's say I push him. There's no real change, is there? To the turn. To his turn, he's still going to be blitzing with his, with his strip ball guy. You just stood him up first, and you know he's still, he's still in kind of like the same trouble he was in. Like I just didn't want to fucking double skull it, you know. Yeah, yeah. Well, he didn't have any choice, did he, Wolfpack? <laughs> Oh, yeah, because he'd have been in the tackle zone. Oh, yeah, yeah, he'd have been in the tackle zone. And he stood up. Yeah, okay, yeah, it probably be, would have been good, yeah. Yeah, okay, yeah, probably would have been a good reroll, yeah. Would have needed not a 1 in 6, then not a 1 in 9, but then they would have they would have been critical. Only 1 in 36 would have been critical. Yeah. Yeah, probably should have rerolled it, maybe, yeah, with 3 left. Because I, I don't want it to slip away. The fact he's still in my half, in his half even, you know, but yeah, maybe I should have done right. I think it's still hard for him to screen it in any in any reasonable fashion. I mean, like that that's that's the thing. I just think it's hard for him to do much. So I'd rather save it for when I've got two dice in the ball or whatever. Hello, VIP sleep this here. Yeah, yeah, and, that, and now I've got a reroll for the two dice next turn, don't I? So, I could go there and push him, push him back this way. That's it. GFI, I wanted to not follow because I wanted to GFI to assist this. But now, if it's a push, it's really bad, isn't it? Or I don't base him. Maybe I should have just followed there. And I've made this dodge to block. next turn. Really yeah, I found two D in the box. He didn't. He didn't move the beast. I thought he'd have blitzed the pestigor and then moved the beast. But uh, good for him. Oh, he's just gonna blitz with the beast. Yeah, that makes sense. Well, not really. Not really. You see, he could have lost his blitz and the ball. Oh, but it means he can base the ball. 
Help the base, base, base. He does love basing things. Good. Fuck you. I don't really want to just base a fucking mighty blow guy. Could block him. Base him. Dodge to blitz. Or just dodge to blitz. And then some block him. Block him, block him. Now, free, freeing up players is good, isn't it? And keeping his players based is good. <laughs> See, every time, every time I re-roll a one, I get a double score. Fuck, maybe I shouldn't have done that GFI then, eh? Fuck's sake. That's why I don't like re-rolling stuff like... That's why I never like using Pro, never like Greed re-rolling, never like re-rolling Foul Appearance, because then that happens, you know? So that's why... That's why it may be... A good idea to re-roll foul appearance or something, but that's why I just fucking never want to fucking do it. Don't feed him the beast, okay? I don't, think, I don't think it's easy for him to score still. He's got no rerolls and only three turns left. So I don't think... Maybe the win's gone. But um, still a draw from this is, is fine, isn't it, at the moment? The way, the way it's fucking gone. I have to blitz the Pestigo. Because it's one of his... Adds three players. I just scatter the ball and go for the just scatter the ball and go for the win, eh? Yeah, all right. That's that. That's the actual play. There, then he can dodge away at the end. He didn't seem interested in trying to win. Two re rolls and players in his house, so I think I'm still more likely to win than he is. Well, yeah, the thing was though, if I, if I failed. 
the thing with the beast is if I moved him without GFIing, then he's just not doing a lot. And it's not about the safe moves first moving him. It's if I failed something else, then he and he's laying down. That's terrible, isn't it? And then if I don't fail anything, and he's standing, not basing somebody. He's not doing anything. So it was like, I don't know. He's not even trying to score. No, he shouldn't activate the beast, should he? That's why I was going for the ball scatter, because it's the only way I was going to get away from the... Uh, away from the beast. That was a disappointing one dice blitz that got him two two dices, including a removal. Come on, roll a one, you bastard. Oh, shit. <sighs> he is in range, isn't he? Fuck's sake. How did he even get into range? He's got a card there. Oh, this is annoying, isn't it? This is really fucking crap now. <laughs> so I have to dodge and double GFI to one dice in. One dice there, get the guard in. And then one, two... Three, four, five, six, GFI. So dodge GFI here. It's going to be the best odds to get him, isn't it? So one dice him, get the guard in, then it's two dice. Yeah, it's a score. Yeah, it's a ball time. Mm. It's a fair touch. Wow, well, imagine... I can't believe I managed to lose this game. Oh... Can't, you can't, you know, get him to fucking roll a one is not going to happen, is it? You ain't going to roll a one. You can't just hope your opponent rolls a one when you, you've got a re-roll and you can do, you know, something better. And turning over a new leaf, I'm going to stop being, you know, insulting people and everything. I mean, hello, VIP beta novel, by the way. Yeah, I've lost this to my blatant inability roll up of a two, exactly. That has been the fucking problem. I double skulls, his fucking. The, the two dice on, on him that wasn't. You know, was the worst possible scatter. Didn't get a power. Glorious! I could not think of a message. <laughs> Thank you very much, Backyard Dodo. <laughs> Thank you very much for staying fantastic. <sighs> Does your non insults include Norse coaches? I don't know if I can handle that. <laughs> yeah, it does. There'll still be banter, but just not insults. There's only one chance. Like, this is better than basing the ball, isn't it? Like, as dumb as this move is, it's just literally better than basing the ball because I can re-roll it and it, it, it just stops him if it's a power. 
Whereas if I fucking if I blitz here, one dice blitz, and then base the ball, he just fucking two dices me and scores. Yeah, because you could block. You could block him down, free him, and then he'd go one, two, three, four, GFI. Just makes him roll some shitty dices. I think. I think these crazy rolls would be better, but okay. No, I Glorious! Happy Christmas, Jimmy! <laughs> Thank you very much, VIP Gurgle. Thanks for staying fantastic. Yeah, but it's the ch percentage chances, isn't it? That's it. At the end of the day, there's ultimately a right and wrong answer based on percentages. Now, <laughs> if I had done nothing, he would have rolled a 1 on his GFR. Just quietly. Armor break there is pretty good, isn't it, actually? So you, you can't reach with him because I moved there. So the only thing is he blocks with him to free him. So I want to herb dirt base base him. Of the options. Blitz him and chain out the beast. But chinning out the beast wouldn't work anyway, would it? So he could block and chain out him or something. I don't know. I don't even know what he can do now. To be fair. I think he's just going to have to one-dice the ball, isn't it? So that actually worked out maybe he's alright. Didn't have a canoring threat. I should have gone out for a canoring threat on my own, shouldn't I? Because he's not doing football. Right? Oh, goodbye, Senai89. And Merry Christmas, Kovo, as well. Yeah, so he actually can't even do the one dice, can he? Just dodge, dodge GFI is his play. But yeah, seeing as I wasn't doing anything with him, he should have uh, he should have gone being the canoning threat, yeah. Yeah, that was very poor. Just do a, just do a random block for... Oh no, yeah, he could have freed up the beast like that. So I, I should have, I should have... I actually should have uh, made that extra GFI. Probably one, two, three, four GFI. Yeah, so that's freed up the piece. So maybe I should have made the GFI, but then I didn't have a reroll for it. And now it makes him make two two pluses. Yeah, I should have, I should have done the GFI myself. Fuck me. So yeah, I shouldn't have made the Canarium threat. Should have absolutely um, done the second GFI and tagged the beast. Thought about it, didn't do it. No, it wasn't under blocks and names, it was the right player. Probably, maybe. They were one in nines though, so...
Yeah, I don't know which is better to make all those two dice blocks or not. No oh, well. Actually shut on. Shut on by dice. And nearly nearly fucking won that, to be fair. Despite it being as one Yeah, it was, wasn't it? It was, that was just bad luck. Yeah, I'm not sure it was better. Yeah. I mean some of the blocks are with block. So But you you were two one in sixes, which is roughly the same as one in three anyway, and then you're adding a one in nine, aren't you? So and a push would have given made him make an extra GFI. So yeah, probably the three plus two plus was the right was was the right move probably. To be honest. <laughs> Play for a riot. I guess there's not there's no, there's not much else to do, is there? Really, than to play for a riot with these few players as well. <laughs> Fucking hell. That was a shame. I mean, that blitz ruined it, everything, didn't it? The good thing is the playing for the right is also playing to maximise our spot. Sets up, still sets up the same way. Yeah, exactly, exactly. Uh, can just roll some fucking dice and lose or win. But I mean, and that was after all the dice roll that had completely murdered my team. <laughs> um, yeah, I feel pretty hard done by there. I don't think he played well. What's even the point? <laughs> What's even the point in rerolling any of that shit? If he's an idiot, he won't stand firm. Oh, well. I mean, if he will stand firm, so. He wasn't, he worked it out. He worked out that I was just gonna fall. Well, from how badly the first half went, then um, it was alright, wasn't it? No perms, apart from the guy who I wanted to fire anyway. So it was better than conceding in the end. But very disappointing, could have won it. It's what it takes to lose a game, I guess. Yeah, focus on the lead. Nah, look, I can still be pissed off in a game, can't I? Um, and still, still shout things and stuff, but I'm just not going to be nasty. I'm not going to be toxic or hostile or anything. It, to be and to be honest, it's really pissed me off when I've seen people doing it. So I'm not going to bad mouth anyone. I'm just going to do my own thing, and that's it. Kind. Yeah, I suspect the three plus two plus was the best. Yeah, exactly. BZL. It is hard because there are multiple points where you can just bail out and do the dodgy if I. That's true. That was a nice. That was a nice chasm. Well, chasm MVP didn't need the Kaz. Like when he got the MVP, but I think I want to guard. But then Claw just lets you get lucky, doesn't he? Should I go Claw and try and get lucky? And then, of course, there's only one. If you were in the Discord last night, there's only. I don't know. I don't want to buy him yet. I haven't. I need him though, don't. Need need to get him skilled up. If you're in the Discord last night, there's only. Uh, there's only, there's only one. And this can be. <laughs> Big boy. <laughs> oh dear. 
That was TV plus working in action, wasn't it? Yeah. Yeah, it was. <laughs> Big boy. <laughs> oh, shit. Right, get, just get two Claw Warriors, but I feel like Guard would have been better in that game when the Claw got a few stuns, but we're really lacking Guard against him, and he only had two. <laughs> I felt like really up against it, but then, similarly, if I'd had two Claw block guys, maybe Zod would have been banging on him a bit, and uh, I had Blitz, though. The Blitz made everything hard, didn't it? Sad. Sad to finally lose. Right, thanks for watching. If you enjoyed it, don't forget to leave a like and subscribe and stay fantastic.